<coughs> I don't know if you can tell, but I'm feeling much better than last week. I'm still not 100% yet, but I'm feeling much more alive. <laughs> <laughs> I just got back from shopping and tomorrow I'm going out with friends for food to celebrate my birthday So I really want gorgeous looking hair tomorrow So I'm gonna do the unicorn heatless curl style from the tutorials that I saw this is gonna be an arm workout and I could never do one braid going all the way down my hair so I might find this a bit tricky to do. <laughs> so for this heatless curls method, I'm gonna be using this that I got from Shein. What I love about this is that it comes with a clip and it also comes with scrunchies. So that's perfect. I don't have to be running around my house looking for everything. I also have a brush with me and I'm thinking of using the Ooklem foam. I don't know. I kind of wish that I just bought a regular hairspray. So I'm just... Taking out this cute clip if I can. <laughs> I washed my hair yesterday because it was absolutely disgusting after not washing it for a week more so than usual and my scalp was very itchy it was not good so i washed it yesterday because after work i went for drinks with some friends and then because i wanted to do this today i also washed it again today because <laughs> i wanted to do it on clean hair um, shall i do a side part i don't know i find it very hard to part down the middle see that look that's not the middle <laughs> that's wonky that's even worse <laughs> And now I've just gone to another side part. Well, maybe I could just you know, brush all my hair back. No, it's gonna do a side part anyway. Side part it is. So I'm only gonna add two pumps of this. You don't really need a lot. And I don't wanna have like really crunchy hair. And the foam kind of adds a little bit of dampness to my hair. So I'm not gonna bother adding any water. This is the before part. My hair feels very soft to me. So I'm supposed to clip this as little as I can at the front just to hold it in place. How the hell do you open this? Oh, this clip is hard <laughs> to open. Okay. Oh no, this doesn't feel right. I'm clipping it too much. Let me bring it forward a bit more. I think that'll be okay. What I'm supposed to do is take a piece of hair, wrap it around as tight as I can, and back under. And then I'm gonna do the same with the other side. This is definitely one of the more fiddly heatless curls to do. I've only just started. This doesn't look right. <laughs> I'm gonna start again. This already feels like I'm getting my hair knotted. How do I have so many knots already? I have no idea how tempted I am to scrap this video idea and instead refilm when I did a scrunchy blowout because the lighting in that video wasn't great. So kind of wanna do a redo. <laughs> I hope that this kink doesn't affect the end result. Okay, so I think what I'm gonna have to do is as I wrap it around to make sure it stays tight, I'm gonna have to hold the pieces in my mouth. So I can't talk. So enjoy this little montage of me doing this.
My arms are so tired and I think we're about halfway through. I don't remember which one I did last. This one. Now that we have ran out of hair to add, we're just gonna wrap this around. Kind of want to try the hack that I did on the octopus curls and push them up and then I think we'll get really tight curls at the end. And now I'm gonna tie those in place. Hopefully I haven't ended up tying them in a strange position. And then we have all this left over, so I saw people just doing this to keep it out of the way. Um, so this isn't the tightest heatless cut. Oh no. <laughs> and tuck it in there somewhere. This is not the tightest heatless curls that I've tried. It is also not the easiest to do, but it may be the comfiest to sleep. Oh, and I think I can remove this now. I don't think I need to leave that in. <laughs> this looks so strange. I don't have high hopes. I feel like it should be tighter than what it is currently, but I don't know. Maybe we'll get like really loose waves and it'll look like I've had a blowout. I did not think through putting this in before I got changed. I kind of think I need to go and redo this again. It is the following day. I am leaving in half an hour, so hopefully this looks okay. Um, it's come much looser now and it is moved, so I don't know. I hope that we have something decent here. Also, it's very windy today, so it's really not the best idea to wear my hair down today, honestly. <laughs> so I might end up putting it up. Well, I think maybe the wind sounds worse than what it actually is. <laughs> Hopefully. Why won't this come off? <laughs> oh god, oh no. Oh no. This isn't coming off as easy as in the videos that I saw. How does it look? <laughs> oh, okay. I can work with this. I'm so hungover today, that head flip was not a good idea. Okay, gorgeous, movie star vibes. I do kind of wish that I had more volume up here. It's looking very bottom heavy <laughs> and up top just kind of looks very flat and that's because I guess of how loose it came, but the bottom looks gorgeous. I hope they stay. I just um, combed it out a little bit to kind of separate the clumps a bit and have it looking a bit more natural and at the back, it kind of was a bit knotty. And it definitely feels like these waves are gonna hold today, but uh, so windy, so, so windy. So yeah, let me know what you think of these results. I would say that I, I really like how it's turned out and it was very comfy to sleep in. <laughs> Zero complaints there. But my only thing would be I wish I had more going on up here but oh well. Enjoy your weekend and I shall see you in the next video. Bye!